guys, I want to bring you a quick effective workout. Not going to lie, today there was a lot of thought of, you know what, I'm just not going to get my workout in today. I'm too busy. I got too much going on. Today's going to be a rest day. And Saturday and Sunday were rest days. Had a killer leg day yesterday. But I knew, hey Todd, what's up? But I knew that I get to practice what I preach, right? And I really do believe that we can have a really effective workout if we plan strategically and know what we're doing or have somebody who knows what they're doing, support us in that, right? So today, if we're gonna be working the chest muscles, the biceps, triceps, and cardio. Like I said, yesterday was legs. Tomorrow is a different area of the body. So that's the target area. Work out at your own risk. Make sure you always consult with your physician and listen to your body. But also, today you may want one to two sets of weights. Maybe one that's medium. Um, and then also a heavier set, right? So it's good. we're gonna go super, super quick on this workout. I'm gonna get the music going. We're gonna start with a warm up, and then we're gonna get right into it. So I'm gonna prompt you, if you want, save this video. If you don't have your weights and your uh, mat with you, uh, in your car, maybe you're driving, then uh, you can always do this later. So let's get ready. Seriously though, to do 15, 20, 30 minutes of exercise, right, and make every minute count, so, so, so much better than not doing it at all, obviously, or like spending like an hour, hour and a half, like kind of wandering around, not really knowing what you're doing, taking lots of breaks, checking your phone, checking your social media, talking, all that stuff. But let me stop talking. Let's get down to business and get some music going. I have my little friend Abby here with us. She cries when I'm not around, so I'm going to get us started in this one. I think we need to take this man out. So to start with, we're gonna open that chest up, having those palms open, or maybe you step it out. We wanna make sure that we have the entire body warmed up. We're gonna do five more. Five, four, three, two, and one. We're gonna walk it out for push-ups. So you're gonna walk out, arms out wide, push it up if you need to, drop down to those knees, and push up and walk it back and swing those arms up. We're gonna do four more. Swing those arms up and this is three. We got two more. Woo! One more. And bring it back up, swing those arms up. One thing I wanna do is I wanna set my watch. I wanna see how much I burn during this workout and also time how long we work out. So we'll add a couple minutes on because I didn't set it right away. All right, here we go. We're gonna repeat this one more time. Maybe a little bit faster this time. Again, remember if you need to, you can step it out. We are gonna make every move count. Here we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We got five more of these walkout push-ups. Bring those arms up, stretch out that core. Woo! You take it where your body's at, okay? No competition here, listen to your body. We got two more. Woo! One more. All right, bring it back in. We're gonna start with biceps. Grab your lighter set of weights here. We're gonna start with 15 regular biceps. That's two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Come on, we got it. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. You're gonna isolate one arm here. You are going to split leg. Come on down in the lunge. I know it's not leg day, but let's make this workout count. Fifteen on this side. Three, nice and controlled. Four. Lengthen that arm. Five, six, seven, eight. I think 
think it's harder when you're talking. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Hold them right here, switch legs. Feels weird. That's all right, here we go. 15 more, two, three, four, five. We're gonna burn out these biceps right now. Six, no it's not. Oh, let's go. Keep with me, eight, nine, hold that other one. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. All right, palms out to the side. We're gonna bring the leg up and down. Guess how many? We're doing 15 again. Those biceps should be feeling it. Woohoo! Come on. You got it. Few more. Really lengthen that arm out. All right. Here we go. Grab those heavier weights. We're going back into those biceps. We got hammer curls this time. One then the other. That's one. You're gonna bring it across the chest towards that opposite shoulder. Don't hit yourself, it hurts. Two. These should be a lot harder. You should be sweating. <laughs> Woo. You wanna challenge yourself? That is how you're gonna see change, right? If it doesn't challenge you, it may not change you. <laughs> We got it. How many is that? We were eight. Whew. That's nine. That's ten. Hang with it. Should be hard. By the time you get to the end, you should be like, oh my god, can I do another one? Come on. Work those biceps. You got it. Few more each side. All right, here we go. Back to the lighter weight. You're gonna come down into plank. We're gonna plank with a bicep curl. We're not done with biceps yet. If you can't plank, that's okay. You're gonna plank from the knees. Grab both sets of your weights. Move quickly, right? We wanna make our time here count. All right, you're gonna be in plank. You want that core down, hips down. Try not to do this, try not to do this, or have those arms too far out. If you need to, drop to the knees. I'm gonna come up on those toes. I'm gonna do 15 again, alternating. Work in the core. Woo! We got it. That's four. Five. Again, drop to your knees if you need to. Totally okay. Keep those hips down. Woo! Almost there. Woo! And four. Curl. Triceps next. All right, I hope you're with me. You want to open that chest up. Bend those elbows, keeping those shoulder blades together. We're going to squat forward, hinge it back. One. Nice flat back. Look at a little bit down at the ground, relaxing the neck, squeezing the back of those arms. Woo, I'm sweating. It's hot in here. That's 10, we got five more, five, four, we're gonna hold it, three, two, one, and hold, hold, squeeze, 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 and release. All right, here we go. Bring both arms up and back. See how my arms are in towards my head? Not out wide, if you can help it, but everybody's anatomy is a little bit different. Here we go, we're adding a calf raise in if you can. 
Come up off those heels. Woo! Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Woo, almost there. Twelve. You got it. Nice job, you guys. Thirteen. Fourteen. And fifteen. Hold it nice and slow. Little pulses. Little pulses. Pulse it. Work those triceps out. Elbows in. Woo! I feel them. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Grab your heavy weight. We're doing. Woo! We're doing. <laughs> I forgot the name. School crushers. Come on down to your back. All right. Grab a weight. Woo. Hear me out. I don't want you to worry. Keep those elbows in. Bring that weight towards your eyebrow. Squeezing it. I don't want you to worry if you can't keep up with this workout. Like I said, we're moving quick. Do your best. As long as you're challenging yourself, you're doing your best, you're going to get a good workout. Woo! And five, four, three, two, and one. All right, we're going to come back up. Now, this is your breast tissue, maybe a hard one for you. You can also grab a chair and do this. I'm going to place my fingers actually, well, out to the side. No, I'm facing them backwards, if you can see here. The only thing really working here, actually, just kidding. Place them. Fingertips are going towards your feet. Maybe out a little bit to the side. Trying to keep those arms behind you. Little dips. Grab a single weight and work a little bit of the chest. Like, don't worry if you can't keep up, keep up. That's okay. Or maybe you're like blowing this to smokes. I don't know. But do what you can. Okay? We're gonna push this weight forward a little bit. This is a elbows out. A little bit of back, a little bit of chest here. Just warm that up before we take it back to the floor. Here again. Getting up and down also challenging. If you get dizzy, easily you want to rise slowly. All right, and grab your other weight. <sighs> Coming back onto the floor. We got some flies here. Come on down to your back, palms together, bend those elbows in, open that chest up, and back up. Keep your pelvis, can you guys see me? Give me a thumbs up if you can see me down here. Woo! Really use those chest muscles, squeeze them at the top. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Bring both weights out wide. And you're going to hold the one on the left and bring that right one up. Two, three, four, five. Focus on those chest muscles. Six, seven, eight, nine. You got it. Ten, eleven. Use the core. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Bring that one other one down and hold it. Two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, woo! Ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Bring them back together. A little bend in the elbow. Open up that chest and hold here. Little pulses. Palms are kind of face up. A little bend in the elbow and pulse it. Pulse it. Pulse it. 
pulse. And if you want to make it harder, bring those legs up. Bring it to tabletop. Make sure your core is engaged. And bring it both up. And low pulses to the bottom. Palms facing away. Here we go. Woo! Keep pulsing. Little bitty pulses. Push, 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 push. Almost there. Worth the chest. Here we go. All right. All right. Move quick. Grab your heavy weights. Heavy weights, heavy weights. Here we go. We got 15 more. This is going to be challenging. And then I'm going to see where we're at with time. We may be going straight into cardio. We may be doing an express round. We'll see. All right. <laughs> wisely, right? Alright, here we go. Alright, we got bicep curls. Woo. Yeah, these are heavy. You want to try to lengthen that arm. Stand up nice and tall. Woo. I gotta switch weights, you guys. Keep going, keep going, keep going with those biceps. want to make this hard on yourself <sighs> but you want to have good form as well that is important let's do 10 more 10 9 8 really focus on those biceps 6 5 4 come on 3 2 and 1 you're gonna hold it out to the side, pulses. Pulses on that upper half. Woo! Four, three, two, one, bottom half. Woo! Four, three, two, and one. We're gonna do tricep push ups. Not gonna lie, these are hard. Um, you can do them from an incline surface. If push ups are not working for you right now, don't worry. I always say, don't worry, because there's always something else you can do, right? Don't worry about it, make it fun. <laughs> Get a good workout. You're gonna go back to this one, okay? Keeping those elbows in. Otherwise, you're gonna come down here. Go ahead, come onto your chest down here, right? Keep those elbows locked in. Maybe you push up to your knees. You want to have the shoulders over the wrist, right? And come down. So you're focusing on the back of the upper arm. Or maybe you're up on your toes and engage the core. Here we go. Okay, we got chest press. 
One more time. Here we go. It's gonna be a fast chest press with your heavy weights down from the ground or on your bench. And then we're going into cardio. Grab those weights. Here we go. Elbows out wide. Breathe out when you come up. Quick on this one. Keep that spine pushed into the floor. Just faster. Stay moving, you guys. All right. What are we gonna do? Here we go. High knees. Bring those knees up there if you need to. Step it out. Remember, we've only got a few more minutes. Every last little bit you got right here. Knees up high. We're adding in a punch. You might feel crazy. That's okay. Come on. Whew. Little more. Whew. All right. We're recovering. Coming down the mountain climbers. Should be hard to breathe. If you need to. Sorry, somebody called. Put your hands up on a raised surface. We got mountain climbers. Come on down. Fast. Here we go. I don't even know. <laughs> yes, I do. All right, here we go. Jump squats with those hips back. Watch those knees. We're going to explode up. If you can't do these, you're going to do fast squats. Here we go. We got 15. One. your breath, but keep your heart rate up there. What's that baby girl? We got 15 half burpees. Let me show you some options. You can come down, walk it back, walk it up, hop, work half raise, or come down and power up. You're gonna come down, plank power up, we got 15. Here we go. We only go for it, we're almost done. I'm done, you guys. Jog around, walk around. We're gonna stretch. Talk to you about a few things. Bring your heart rate down first. Woo. We're at about the 23 minute mark. Woo. I do realize this style of workout is not necessarily possible for everyone with such a high intensity. But listen to me, it's okay, right? You can do your best, right? Everything you got 
in 20 to 30 minutes. And remember, proper planning. Know what you're working on what day. Have a regimen, right? If you need help with that, I can help you with that. Stretch out those triceps. Stretch in this muscle here. And get a great workout. Now, I'm not against longer workouts, but I also know a big restraint for people is time, right? Right? What are some reasons that you're not able to exercise sometimes, right? May not feel like it. May think it's gonna be really hard, uncomfortable. You don't have time, you don't know what to do. But hear me, the new year is coming, right? And you know you wanna feel great for it. <laughs> so start now, it's gonna help you manage your stretch, stretch, manage other arm, manage your stress during the holidays, right? To have a routine. Put those fingertips behind the back, open that chest up. Whew. Cross the fingers, maybe you stay here, or perhaps you fall forward and bring them up. Stretch out the hamstrings too. Come back up, undo them, palm down. Hey, Rishi. Hey, Sarah. Okay. So perhaps right now you're in a walking routine. Awesome, okay? Make those 20, 30 minutes, if that's all you're gonna walk, make them count, right? Do your speed intervals. Maybe you grab a light set of weights with it. Um, if you're only working out a few days a week, maybe you wanna do a full body workout for your um, 20 to 30 minute workout if that's what you're choosing to do. For me, right, I have a six day a week program that I'm, that I'm in right now that I'm doing. So I work certain body parts every day and that cardio in here and there. But it's up to you and it's also up to your goals, up to where your body's at. But one thing, be really grateful that your body can do this, right? Um, a friend of mine, Rachel Webb, you may have seen me post about her. Right now she would do anything, right, Rach? To, to walk, right? To walk easily. So we're so blessed if we are able to move our bodies, right? In any way, shape, or form, right? It really is a blessing. So um, be grateful with where we're at, right? It's easy to do that comparison game or I'm not at that speed or I can't do that, right? That's okay, that's not even what it's about, right? So feeling good, being grateful, owning your health, owning where you're at, okay? So if you guys have any questions about this workout or feedback or you wanna know like, hey, I'm doing this in my regimen, what do you think about it? Let me know. Also make sure if you're doing strength training, you wanna go ahead and get you some lean protein, preferably 15 to 20 grams within about 20 minutes. I'll go have a protein shake. Then I'm heading to the eco-friendly Thanksgiving dinner tonight, so I'm excited about that. I almost did not, oh, come here, Abby. I almost did not uh, get this workout in, but again, right, uh, what we prioritize, we make time for, she's probably hurting her eyes. Um, and so, sometimes a lot more is possible than we actually know, right? Um, but again, <laughs> I always have like, oh, but also, <laughs> you want to um, protect your, your time, and it's very, Precious of spending it doing what you love with the people that you love as well, right? But Parkinson's law says if you give yourself two days to do something, you'll get it done in two days. And if you give yourself two weeks, you'll get it done in two weeks. So like today, I could have said, yeah, I'll get my workout in tomorrow. But then I said, you know what? I can get a workout in in 20 some minutes. So let's check the calories here. We're at about, we'll say 25 minutes or 25 minute workout. As you can see, it was mostly strength based. There was some cardio in there. Working upper body likes tend to burn more calories. And my average heart weight was 125. Burned 172 calories. Not horrible, not fantastic, but I'm happy with it, right? And I got, as you can see, I'm sweating my butt off, but I gotta run. Please, 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 again, let me know. What are your workouts like? What are you enjoying or not enjoying about your workouts? Let's talk. Also, if you have not seen um, the last 31 program and you really are interested in finishing this year, feeling happy, healthy, less stress, right? Just like rocking what you started all year long and really ready to bring the new year in, then let's talk. Goodbye, I hope you guys have a great, great night. Also, stay tuned because I have some good Stuff coming up at the end of the week. Bye. Woo!